Hey, MJ. Harry and I stayed up doing tests on his suit. And we may have had too much pizza. It was really nice. <laughs> Just like the good old days. So I gotta know, what's Harry's radioactive spider? I've never seen anything like this before. It's some kind of exosuit that completely eradicates any trace of his disease. Dr. Connors really outdid himself this time. That's incredible. And great timing, considering what happened at the park. Any leads on where they might have taken Tombstone? Not yet, but if I hear anything, you're my first call. Oh, you're the best. Yeah, I know. Okay, what's next? We still haven't figured out who made that weird spider bot. are to be believed. These Spider-Men have grown more powerful than we feared. Magic portals, subway cars disappearing off the tracks, fire engines flying through the night sky, and the newer Spider-Man at the center. Webbing and property damage weren't enough. Now we add mystical arts into the mix. Does their desire for destruction know no bounds? I almost feel sorry for this lost soul, groomed for a life of criminality and degradation. Speaking of it, it seems Spider-Man was cohorting with notorious thief, the Black Cat. Their costumes must be cut from the same corrupt claw. If their entanglement doesn't paint a clear enough picture of Spider-Man's intent, then here's a little story for you. The Spider-Men show up, and the group we now know as the Hunters follow. Clearer now? These Spider-Men are magnets for malefactors. Now, the Black Cat seems to have vanished. Good riddance! If magic is indeed real, then we must hope upon hope that someone out there is using it for good and will erase the stain in our city known as the Spider-Men. May we go one day without another spider incident. For you. Head to this location. Felicia? Hey, Felicia. Heard some chatter about the steel foundry in Williamsburg off a radio I swiped from those hunters. Sounds like tombstones there. He could use your help. I gotta do a thing. One sec. <laughs> Sorry, we got cut off. 